and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Pula at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to be going over some of the daily kind of content. I wouldn't call it card type content. More so, things that they are implementing into the game on this fine Monday, guys. And it is kind of interesting that they're doing this. I guess they're trying to help out for all the people, you know, who are stuck quarantined at home right now. Can't go to work or kind of just bored at home on Madden all day playing video games. Which I think is a great thing for them to be doing. Because, guys, obviously, a lot of you guys, I mean, I do content. I'm creating content on a daily basis. I'm kind of kept busy for the most part. But for people who just strictly play the game and are stuck home with not much to do this is a great thing to do especially people who are just sitting here trying to level up trying to play the game now, as you guys do know there's quite a few things to go over in terms of how to, how to take advantage of it and what's coming out but guys as you guys do know they are implementing double xp as well as implementing weekly challenges now i'll get into that in just a second guys before we get into the video make sure to go down below hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel make sure to turn that notify bell boys come join the family we're still grinding out to 22k before the end of madden 20 gonna try to get there a nice i think stand like starting point for the next man so let's keep it growing make sure to comment down below if you guys have any questions regarding any of this and give this video a big thumbs up all your thumbs up always do help the channel grow thank you guys so much for all the support as of late now guys getting into all this as you guys do know double xp pretty self-explanatory the xp you gain per game is now double so imagine like if you played 100 solo challenges you really got 200 xp worth like you got 200 games worth of xp it's very simple very straightforward now the beauty of this is this guys with the glitchy type of solo challenge that we use to level up, which is Technicolor Commentary, which I'll go over it later in this video, that solo already allows us to level up. I can go from level 90 to level 100 in approximately three and a half hours. If you play straight, guys, no distractions, just play, watch some Netflix, streak it, start over. If you do that, you can probably get it in three and a half hours. Guys, with double XP, that pretty much means you can get it down in about one hour and like 45 minutes, which is super crazy. You can go from level 90 to 100. Now, for all you guys who are level 50 to 100, you can probably get like in seven hours, eight hours, you could probably get close to level 90, 100, even if you're like level 50. And if you're like level zero, just starting, you could probably get to level 100. And I'd say a few days if you played straight. Now it's like day, no, okay, not like days straight, but like you could get it done. If you play like five hours a day, you could probably get it done by the end of this XP. Guys, that's a OP double XP. Just take advantage of it, guys. You can easily, between level 90 to 100, get probably, I'd say, you get over like 1.7 million coins worth of value because you get the 99 pass, which gets you a player worth like 600k. You get the 90 pass, which gets you another player, which you can use on Nitro Lane, which is 600k. That's 1.2 mil right there. Plus, you get the Legend Fantasy packs, which are 180k each, another 360,000 coins, which is about 1.56 million coins right there. 1.56 million coins. And then plus the quick sales and everything, you can easily get upwards of 1.8 million coins worth of value. So make sure you're taking advantage of that level up grind. Very simple. Go get it done. And if you guys know what I'm talking about, all the level up rewards you get are over here in serious progression. Go to my level. You'll see everything you can get for doing so. Now, guys, we're also going to have the weekly challenge, which I recommend you start taking advantage of because as you guys do know, the weekly challenges are being implemented into Madden, I believe, starting today. Now, the way they work is that you pretty much get rewarded for the certain things that you do on a weekly basis. Now, I'm going to pull up the list in just a second on the screen. So we can go over everything. Guys, yeah, just a little golden ticket info to throw in there. Kralo did announce today that they are not officially done with them yet. They're still waiting to receive some of the golden ticket selections, I guess, from certain people. I guess today's maybe the last day, right? 10 days. Today's one of the last days, I think, to actually submit it. I think you get 10 days. So they're waiting for all the submissions. Once they get every submission in, they will be starting to start the creation process. Like I said, and I'll say in later video, and I think I mentioned today too as well, it will not be, I think at the earliest we'll see them is sometime next week going into the first week of april i think between that we'll at least get info by that point i don't think we'll be seeing them for at least another week or two but that's pretty much covers the golden ticket info a lot of people are thinking they would come out thursday and that's just not the case all right guys turn up the face cam so you guys can see so new weekly objective list so the way this is going to work is pretty much follow these objectives and you will be rewarded so reset each week on monday so this just should be implemented i believe today win seven games in solo battles two times elite player packs that alone right there great value wins and solo battles is simple just go play it you can knock them out in like 15 20 minutes each very simple. if you just do two clock bowl game win seven games in head to head seasons two times game changer pack very simple to do could take you a few hours win seven games in squad seasons one game changer pack and elite player pack now squad seasons isn't hard but you're gonna need a squad so if you play alone that one's gonna be a little bit harder for you guys win five games in weekend league literally so simple guys you're gonna hop into a few rage quits a few disconnects it'll be super simple Fifty thousand coins win 10 games in weekend league 50,000 coins a little bit harder still pretty simple fullest completion which i think is kind of stupid is only 1,000 coins if i do that whole list i just get like another pack or something but if you do everything here you get two elite player packs well, total you get three elite player packs three game changer packs and 100,000 coins so 
Why you're home, guys, you're sitting home, you're quarantined right now, play this, knock these out. You could save up all these coins for the next few weeks. Could it help you with this and the level up grind? Could easily get you a golden ticket worth of coins. Very simply, save these packs though. In my my opinion, save these packs from golden tickets or free agency LTD drops because right now there's not much in packs that's worth like oh my god like banger pull. I recommend you save some of these for the golden ticket cards because that could be super beneficial if you have six free packs for golden tickets, especially for guys like me and you guys who don't really open packs too much. Could definitely be beneficial. Now, the easiest one for me, in my opinion, would be five games a week in league. I, I think it's kind of fun playing online. Hop into it, knock it out pretty quick. Ten games, not too bad either. The one that would be most annoying for me probably would be the squad seasons because you have to depend on other people. And then maybe solo battles just because they're boring. Not hard, but they're boring. Headset seasons, great too. And remember, guys, it doesn't just end there. You get ten wins in weekend league. You also get the weekend league rewards, which could be easily another 50K plus trophies plus packs. It could also be in headset seasons. You finish a season, trophies and extra coins. Plus, you get the coins you get per uh, win, which depending on your division could still be pretty good. Guys, there's a lot of potential with this stuff. This forces you to play their game, which I know I know you guys don't want to do that. But if you do all these, you also get rewards for solo battles, season squad, and we can leak coins and all. When all is said and done, you could probably end up with the 200k value plus the packs. When you get all the rewards for solo battles, headset season squads, we can leak and we can leak. And you get all the trophies. Pretty great value, guys. I highly recommend you start doing these as of today. Get these done nice and early in the week so you guys can just relax and play some Madden and other places where you want to play. All right, so just some screenshots here to show you guys what else is coming out. So you guys obviously saw this screenshot right here on the right. Moving on to the next one, double XP should be starting today as well. Like I said, I don't know when it'll exactly go live. Don't kill me. As you guys know, EA's famous for saying things are coming and being a little late on it. Got to be in game. So it could be up already by the time this video comes out. I'd have to check on that afterwards, but I do know it will be coming. Moving on to the next part is Open Weekend League, which is pretty cool for all you guys who might have been like, oh man, Weekend League gives us rewards, but I didn't qualify for it. It's open for everyone, which is smart because it'd be very dumb if all the people who haven't been playing couldn't qualify. So Open Weekend League, guys, just so you guys know, Open Weekend League means a lot of noobs, like a lot of guys who aren't so great at the game can get in, which also means it should be a lot easier for you guys to get your 5 to 10 wins. So take that into consideration as you guys go across. And new weekly objective list resets every Monday morning. So you guys already know that one. Pretty much covers that. Let's head back onto the Madden screen so I can show you guys the solo challenge to be playing right now. Going over to challenges, just so you guys do know exactly what to be playing during this time period to abuse your double XP. Head on down to the Mutt Hero solo challenges. Still the glitchiest solo that just gives you a ton of XP. Go down to Booth Breakers and go to the first one, which is Technicolor Commentary. This solo challenge gives you a ton of XP per play. Not to mention the fact that it also does go super fast. Guys, no joke. Just streak your receiver, send him on a deep post, lead him, catch the ball. And if they do, if they are tight coverage on you, just wide, aggressive catch it. Decent chance you come down, you break the tackle on the way down, you run to the end. And if you don't do it in two plays. Now remember guys, on the solo, it's like a house rule style. If you do get sacked, they do get 10 points. So if you get sacked twice, restart the solo, because I'm pretty sure you can't win at that point. So just know that if you get sacked twice, just restart the solo. But for the most part, you can easily get through about a, two solos a minute, probably. It's very simple, which means you can probably do 60 solos an hour, which technically is 120 solos an hour, because you're at a double time space. But guys, that pretty much wraps up this. Super simple. You can easily get from level 9 to 100 in about an hour and 45 minutes. I highly recommend you guys go ahead. And you do play through the solo challenge, because it's super simple. I'm going to get on this grind probably later today at some point so I can get all my rewards. And I'll probably save those Ultimate Legends. Actually, no. I'll probably open the Fantasy Packs in tomorrow's video so that I can see if I can pull one of the new Ultimate Legends, which would be super cool because they are 98 overalls, especially that Okoye. That'd be super cool if I pulled that one. But that is about it for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy today's video, guys. I hope this covered a lot of what you need to know. Guys, at least Madden's doing some of their part in helping us take advantage of some of all this free time we have and just have fun. Giving us objectives, because as you guys know, at this point in Madden, which I do like that they're doing, I'm a guy that's objective-based. I don't like just playing games just to play them sometimes. I like objective-based. Like, when I play 2K, I like getting badges on my my career play. When I play Ultimate Team, I like grinding out coins and getting trophies for a player. I don't just like playing freelance playing. Like, I'm not, that's why I've never been the biggest Call of Duty fan. I can play for, like, an hour or two if I'm leveling up. But once I'm tired of leveling up, eh, I don't even want to play anymore. I'm very objective-based. So, I know a lot of you guys probably are, too. So, in terms of this game giving us objectives like, okay seven games in weekend league 10 games in weekend league seven games solo battles you gotta keep knocking them out once you're done you're like oh i'm bored now but then you get your rewards at the week start again very nice to have objective based stuff as well as the double xp guys is a very huge aspect as soon as that does go live i really love this double xp guys i will be hitting level 100 this week with double xp you guys you guys are crazy if you don't think i'm hitting that instead of wasting three to three to four hours three and a half hours knock it out an hour and a half mindlessly be done with it have all my rewards super hyped that we have that opportunity guys i'm happy i wasn't like one of the guys who did a day one like zerk 
obviously he got he got to make a video on it but on the other hand i'm saving some time here gonna be a whole hell of a lot easier this time around so i'm super excited for that guys but that is better for the video hope you guys did enjoy today's video if you are new to the channel make sure down below hit that subscribe button turn that on you boys come join the family make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you guys did enjoy comment down below if you have any questions and subscribe to the channel thank you guys so much for watching enjoy the rest of your day i'm out see you guys next video peace